Welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Exilia. My name is Lacer Nexus, and we are standing on the bridge to Orta Palace. Now, I changed up Jude's attire again. I went back to his original attire because um, one thing I noticed while level grinding, which I did, is... Leon's costume actually changes the battle theme, and I never actually showed Jude's, or um, I never showed the actual battle theme for the second chapter of the story. Also of note is some of the changes I've made to other characters' attires. Um, I've changed Rowan's hair, I literally took the spike banks and flipped them upside down. Uh, Alvin didn't do anything. Leia, I used the spike banks to make little feather things coming out of her hair, which I think is cute. And I think that's about it. I also got everyone new weapons. Blazing Fury, Rune Blade, Ep well, I got most people new blade. Uh, Mako, Fountain Rod, Eternal Flame. And finally, we look at the Illyrium Orbs. Also, take a look at my level first. 39, 38. I have started working on the second Lilium Orb already. And... Well... I've unlocked everyone's arcane art. Meaning we now have access to our mystic arts. So that's the extent of the level grinding that I did. So now, we're going to head off to Orta Palace. So I'll say right now, I woke up maybe 20 minutes ago. Huh. I figured security would be tighter than this. I don't suppose we could just charge inside. That wouldn't be prudent. This is their stronghold. Rowan? What's the matter? I was just weighing options. I think Jude might have the right idea here. Whoa, hey now, are you serious? For once, Mila's telling us to be cautious and not charge in. Do you have a plan? More of a hunch, actually. Shall we test it? If it's good enough for Rowan, count me in. Stop right there! Attack! Yeah. Now! Yeah. Attack! Yeah. No brakes. Savage roar! No brakes. No brakes. I'll cover you. Please provide support. Now. Understood. I'll cover you. Savage roar! Now. Now. You did it. Alright, well, I was going to show off Rowan's right there, but, uh, completely unnecessary. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, before the cutscene started, because I completely, uh, forgot that there was a cutscene coming up, because I didn't know that, um, I, have, I don't have anything going up on the day recording this, so, uh, I'm going to be skipping a day of uploads, which sucks, but oh well. 
Anyway, you saw right there Jude's new Mystic Art, Savage Roar. Arcane Art, whatever. Any reinforcements? Looks clear. But this is the king's house. Shouldn't he have more soldiers? It could be a trap. No doubt the Rashagal army has already been deployed for war with Ajul. But wouldn't they tighten security around the royal palace in wartime? Except for the natural and man-made barriers that protect Fenmont in the north and south, it has few defenses in the event of a siege. If the enemy army breaches its walls, the city is as good as fallen. Troops are wasted here in wartime, so the majority of them are deployed to fortify the naval defenses in Fort Gondala. That makes sense. But it also means war is imminent. We can't waste this opportunity. Indeed. I just realized I forgot to do something. I will be right back. Alright. So that's going to be fun to sync back up. I'm going to have two, vi two video files, one audio file. Great. This is a lotus ring. A device that ferries people throughout Order Palace. We must use it to proceed further. All aboard? Oh, this will be fun. No, not there. Let's move my phone. Alright, let's go. Ooh. That's pretty. Oh, that doesn't look good. What is this thing? I admit I haven't seen anything like it before. It seems to be an art designed specifically for security. I've never seen such a thing. I guess just walking through there was too much... to help for naturally but this won't be enough to stop us whoa and snap no breaks fall please provide support carry cool down blue spear no breaks seven feet Steel! Launch wall! Flame Hey! Yes. I say that worked out very well. Oh. No cutscene? Okay. Alright. Let's see. Ooh. So there's doors up here and all around. Attack! What are we? <sighs> are you okay? You look pale. I'm fine. I just keep thinking about Hamil. What happened there isn't your fault. You should try forgetting about it. <sighs> I guess that's easier said than done. Maybe it would help to go see Hamil for ourselves. Attack. I can't believe I'm visiting Orda Palace. It's like a dream come true. This isn't visiting. This is breaking and entering. Welcome to Rashagal's Most Wanted. Oh boy. So I'm assuming we're going up. My, my, how foolish. <laughs> Why do you even bother? Onward. Wait, come forth. You, please. Huh? Huh? Understood. 
So I assume all of these other rooms are dead end. I feel like I should say something. If they are all dead ends, they are dead ends with treasures. Pineapple gels, I won't argue with that though. I want to take a look around, but I think this is the only floor I'm going to actually just straight up explore. Because um, if every floor is like this, this is going to take a really long time to explore everything. Uh, we just got a rune circlet. So I'll give that... to Mila. Give her the bronze circlet. It's not the button I wanted to push. For whatever reason, I tried to press the triangle button to open a door. Frickin' Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon has me, um, all mixed up in the head. Whoa, that... That looked important. I'm gonna ignore that guy over there. And... What's in here? Jet Black Feather. I can use that eventually. Once I get enough of them, anyway. You guys are idiots. Why would you look at the wall? Hmm. Is that really all there is? Like, is there a big thing coming up? I killed the thing with steel. That is absolutely incredible. I'm pretty sure steel wasn't. I'm pretty sure steel is an art that's not even not even supposed to be used as a as an attack, more of a stat buff. It just does damage naturally. And I killed something with it, so uh, that's one for the record books. It appears some rats have snuck into the palace. They should be here any moment. Who are these vermin? I needn't have asked. <clears throat> so you've arrived, Maxwell. And looking much more spry than I expected after your injury. All to stop you. Go wait by the lamps. We'll obliterate those northern savages as soon as I'm finished with Maxwell. As you wish. Ilbert. 
Will you really raise your sword against your master? My only master is Lord Klein. There is no other. I am willing to forgive such insolence, if you return to my side. Once I thought you had the potential to be a great king, but now I see you've become unworthy of the throne. Hmm. <laughs> no one in this world is more worthy to sit upon this throne than I. You still don't get it, do you? You lack the qualities needed to govern humanity. Foolish girl. A king only needs one quality, birthright. He is born into his power. So he can sacrifice his own people? Of course. Again, that is my birthright. Now I'll extend my influence over the spirit realm as well. You will control no one. No man and no spirit either. Foolish boy. Has Maxwell's impudence rubbed off on you as well? You can call me whatever you want. Do you have any idea how much your actions have tormented Rowan here? Any idea at all? Jude, please. You people think peace is some sort of right. You are mistaken. Peace is a luxury, not a right. Surrender yourselves into my service. That is your duty as my subjects. You are beyond salvation. I'm through wasting my time with you. Let's put an end to this right now. I now share all of the mana absorbed by the Lance of Kresnik. Once I believed that you and I were two friends who traveled along the same path in life. However, now it seems we've reached our journey's end. With a philosophy like that, life must be convenient. But your beliefs have become a royal pain to all of us. They're just illusions of grandeur. I can't believe that someone like this could be our king! It's time someone knocked some sense in you! Jude, and Mila, and everyone! I have to protect my friends! Off with his head! Off with his head! Someone needs to put a stop to your ambitions! And... That would be us! Prepare yourself, Noctigal! Now I shall show you... The power that will unite Riz and Maxia! If you wish to fall from grace, then let it be by my hand. Are you capable of such when your spear is dulled? This spear has granted unity and resolve to this country, now and forever. We shall see, old friend. But enough talk. There is no greater language than that of war. Have at you! Very well, so be it. It all ends here. Indeed! Destruction! Please provide support. Rage onward. Please! Understood. Look out! Look out! Let's go! Flame Fury! Healer isn't looking good. Don't worry. I'm here with you. Please provide support. Burn! Destruction! Spirits! Tidal wave! Stay strong! Stay strong! Stay strong! Stay strong! Stay Please now. provide support! Strike! Final Fury! Onward. Shall we cool down? Hey, I'll break their guard! Destruction! Please! Each time you know your place! Onward! Tyrant Spear! Symphony of Spirits! Guard the skies! Air pressure! Uh, uh, Heal of fate! Apocalypse Tools! Fatal Circle! Please provide Apocalypse support! Apocalypse Seal! Uh, 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 air pressure! Kill. Destruction! Time to go to work. But of course. Uh, uh, Let's go! Roger! 
Time to go to work. Of course. Flame spear. It's time you know your place. Tyrant spear. Whoa. Heaven or earth shall contain me. Demon slaves. I'm sorry. Everyone is thanks to you. Apocalypse flash. Roar. On the blade. Not yet. Strike. Me too. Please provide support. Steering the Guardian Grove. It's time you know your place. Heaven or earth shall contain me. Demon's lies. Carry me. Everyone. No problem. Yeah. Apocalypse go. That's one. Slave spear. Uh, they are. Attack. No yeah. Apocalypse go. Yeah. You no fools. Yeah. Oh. You. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Hell before me. Windland. Look out. No Healer. Let's go. Roger. Apocalypse go. Spirit spiral. Apocalypse hook. Oh Savage roar. Strike! <laughs> Final Fury! Yeah! 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 But I am king! Noctagall, you have lost. I request that you stand down. Oh my god, fuck that boss! The f he used his fucking mystic art, like. 10 seconds into the goddamn battle at one time. Okay, so, um, note to self. Get the fuck away when they go into overlimit. Even if you don't see the red exclamation point, get the fuck away. Immediately. That sucked. That really sucked. You fools, if you kill me, then you will be unwittingly handing Rashikal over to Gaius. Regardless, as king, you must answer for your crimes. Nonsense. With the Lance of Kresnik, I shall have absolute power. That's enough. Mankind wasn't meant to wield such power. It would destroy the world as we know it. And you as well. <laughs> Mira, wait! This man is Rowan's friend, so Rowan should handle it. Noctagall. A country without its king is doomed to chaos. You have turned away from the responsibility you must bear. We have both turned away. King Noctagall. Ilbert, you're not saying that I should... Let us build a new future for Rashigal together. You mean, you would bear the burden of my crimes as well? It's of no consequence. Rowan... <laughs> Do it. Yes, Master. Who is it? Who's there? No, they must be after... The Lance of Krisnik! Don't worry about me. We must hurry. 